I am Father John Parks. I'm the priest of the Diocese of Phoenix, Arizona. Now, sometimes you hear people, when they fall in love, they talk about the first time they saw their spouse. And so you hear a man say something like, I remember the first time I saw my wife, she was wearing blue, and she was so beautiful, and I'll never forget that moment. One of my favorite stories in Scripture is from 1 John, when one of the early disciples encountered Jesus. And the Scripture said that they were following him, and he turned around and said, what are you looking for? And uh, they said, Rabbi, where are you staying? And he said, come and see. And the scripture said that they stayed with him that day, and it was about 4 o'clock in the afternoon. That's what the scripture say, which can only mean that it was so impactful when they encountered Jesus of Nazareth that years later, when they were recounting this story, they remembered what time of day it was. Like when a person sees that person they're going to marry, it changes everything to encounter Jesus. Pope Benedict wrote a document called Deus Caritas S, God is Love. And he says, being a Christian is above all not a philosophy, it's not an ethical system. It is above all an encounter with the living God. And this God has a name and, and a face. This God is Jesus. And he says, if you want to be happy, if you truly want to be happy, this happiness, Jesus, who has a name and a face, is waiting for you in the Blessed Sacrament. One of the initial steps of being a disciple is you encounter Christ. You encounter him in a living way. And if we want to be authentic witnesses of Jesus to other people, we need to constantly ask ourselves, what difference has Jesus made in my life? Because if he has, if I have had this encounter, I have received the Holy Spirit, and I should be living out now a docility, meaning that when the Spirit moves, I want to do what the Spirit says. So that's what it means to be a Christian above all, is that I've had an encounter with this living God, whose name is Jesus. He's changed my life, and I live in a new way because of that encounter.